Hey everyone, Daniel Webster here from Pocketnow.com, and this is a new segment called Windows Phone 7 App Roundup, and it's similar to our Android Application Weekly, in which we review five applications in 30 seconds each. So let's get started. Go Voice is a Google Voice application that ties directly into your Google Voice account. So you can get all of your text messages, your voicemails, you can also get all your information if you'd like. You can uh, see one of these contacts and you can also call them or send a text message directly to them through your Google Voice account. So if I want, I can go down here to this plus sign at the bottom and I can either type in a message if I'd like or I can just dial a phone number and hit call and that will call my contact. In the settings, we can move to trash, archive, mark as unread, save contact, and email a conversation. Morpho is a pretty neat application that allows you to turn your friends or family or whoever into a three-dimensional little character that you can edit. So let's say I wanted to edit this face here. I can change all the colors and shapes of their face. I can also go back here and it has some other cool effect. Let's say I wanted to make this girl rather fat. All I have to do is hit the fat button at the bottom and I can make her fat. I can also add makeup and I can make her rock out and it will render your friends or whoever's face into a three-dimensional image on the program. Max and the Magic Marker is a fun yet challenging puzzle slash adventure game similar to those doodle games that you have to draw various objects to complete the level. So right here I have to draw a bridge with the amount of ink that I have in my pen. So hopefully I have enough so I can just draw over here and now it looks, it looks as though I hit max. So now I can cross this waterway and I can continue on. So now I need to make another bridge. I can just do that here and the levels continue on throughout the game. Point is a location-based application that will help you find any one of these subjects. So let's say that I wanted to find a restaurant. All I have to do is click on here and I can either choose a restaurant nearby or I can search or choose a specific cuisine. So I'm just gonna choose restaurants nearby. So I have all of these restaurants here. Let's say well, that I wanted to choose Captain Jack's Bar and Grill. All I have to do is click on here. I can get directions, map. I can also call them and send it to a friend. I can also go back to the front of the page and get weather information. I'll just click on here and it shows me the current forecast as well as what is coming up. This game is called Glider and the object of the game is to fly around these different worlds and collect these rings and gems and all this other cool stuff. It does tie in directly to your Xbox Live account so you do get G if you uh, get certain achievements. So the game uses the accelerometer as well as the touchscreen to navigate through these different worlds. And as you can see I can collect some of the uh, gems here. And here I'm in an area where there's an updraft. So if I crash into the ground then I lose the game. So this has been the first video of the Windows Phone 7 app roundup. And if you like our videos, make sure you give us a thumbs up and also leave some comments down below. To get the download information, just follow the link in the description to be directed to Pocketnow's website where we've posted links that'll integrate with their Zune software. Of course, you can always search for these applications in Marketplace by their name. Thanks for watching.